So I am back from a short break from War Thunder and I hope you guys did have a good Valentine's Day weekend because I spent most of it playing Sea of Thieves. Now, I did pick it up on sale uh, through the Lunar New Year's stuff on Steam and I figured I'd blow a lot of time playing that game and I can tell you right now, it is a ton of fun. So maybe it's something you'll see a little bit later in the channel itself, but that's, uh, that's a who knows situation, but we'll definitely see. So with that being said, I figured we go ahead and make our return all about the M48 Super. Now I know I've covered this vehicle before in, in good detail, but quite a bit of it hasn't really changed. I'm not trying to hype it up really quick, okay? I promise, all right? Uh, this vehicle has not really changed too much outside of the fact that uh, it does, well, sit a little differently in the meta. What I mean by that is it now faces 10.3 Russia. I wouldn't say it faces it consistently, but let me tell you right now, this thing fighting uh, uh, T90As, T72V3s, etc., it, it's a little bit of a rough vehicle, but it's a vehicle that I deeply enjoy nonetheless, mostly because... There's a little bit of a bias behind it. I do enjoy the M48s and the M60s, maybe not in the game itself, but in real life. And so, yeah, why the heck not take a look at a vehicle that kind of combines some of the best things uh, at the not so top tier while still playing against top tier, if that makes sense. And I say it like that because this vehicle has a few things that are, well, that is incredibly wrong with it. One of the biggest things being that it may not be a top tier vehicle, but it does have top tier prices. Now, what you're seeing right here in these images, these are images of it uh, of the module cost for it and using this thing with heat fs at 9.3 is rough and i mean it's really rough and when you have you know the ability to fight 10.3 with vehicles that have you know contact 5 relic etc it puts you in a really bad position so why not take this bad boy out one of my favorite vehicles and just kind of try to do some good in it and see if it's a vehicle really worth its price but let's be honest here with those top tier prices for each module cost i wouldn't necessarily say it is but we are going to find out in today's video now some quick highlights about the vehicle itself that make this in my opinion a little bit worth it is the fact that no it doesn't have good armor that's i know it's, i know it's a negative but what it does have is generation one thermal sites for the gunner and a commander thermal site, which apparently you never really had it in real life, but I, I can't confirm it, but it's here in War Thunder, so may as well use it while we've got it. So with that being said, let's dive right into it and see how many up tiers we actually get. So surprisingly enough, I, uh, I get a full down tier. Okay, maybe not a full down tier, but it appears to be a good down tier with us being the top dog. So hopefully this is going to go well because that means I'm fighting in more or less the premium tier, but we'll find out as we go. We got contact out there, 1800. I hit him. I, I can't quite see him. I, oh, there he is. God, I missed him. Okay. Oh, yeah, let's, uh, oh, yeah, let's not stay here. Let's, yeah, let's definitely not stay here. 1700. Oh, God. <laughs> they're all going to have laser rangefinders and they're going to kick my butt right now. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, we're shot. Yep. I'm on fire. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, he potatoed it. I'm not, though. Beautiful. Oh, crap. That guy's gunner loader. Okay, we only got set on fire. We're okay. Uh, man, I should have been staying here. Sorry, I haven't played most of the weekend. 1300. It's about right here, maybe. Oh, boy. Nope, he potatoed it. I didn't. Right to his breach. Beautiful. Oh, a little friend's back right here. Come on, fire, fire, please. Thank you. Radiator engine. Oh my god, how many XM1s are there? Seriously? Go ahead and knock this guy out really quick. Ugh. There goes my loader. Oh man. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We're okay. Oh, we're not okay. Ooh, no. Okay. You gotta kind of time yourself with the movements and their shots. Okay, loader's up. Let's see if I can waste this guy. I can't. Ugh. Got something important though. I got something important too, so I guess we're kind of trading. Yeah, this the armor on this thing does not do very well against Sabos at all. So, uh, best thing to do tonight, I guess. And the fixed sight too doesn't help. Oh, wait, is this guy gonna help me? Oh, dude, is he gonna be a champ? Hold up, hold up, this guy's gonna be a champ. Oh, dude, you are awesome. This guy, Attic, if you're watching the video, man, thank you. You're awesome. <laughs> okay, we are back up, and ooh, there's our little friend right there. Let's see if we can waste him. 
I'm on a critical. Uh, there's a helicopter to my left, and I have a crap reload. He is on fire. I don't know if he shot or not, but I think he's... Uh, I don't think he has FPE, but there's a striker right next to him. Let's get the striker. Come on. Uh, no. Is that a friendly? No, that is... No, that's not a friendly. Okay. Um... Hey, uh, you wanna? Okay, maybe not this time. I don't blame you, buddy. I'll just, I'll just wait. Okay. So, here's my plan. My plan is to kind of counter those who are sniping us right here, and then move forward and capture the point. But I'm probably not going to be able to do that. Not well, anyways. Ooh. Oh, come on! Don't shoot at me, please. You stay right there, little striker. I screwed up. See, it, it, come on. This thing's got great reverse speed. Look at that. You can shoot and scoot really well. <laughs> I'm trying to hype this thing up, okay? Okay. Let's see about countering these guys that are setting up here. It's this this hill, man. It's such an OP spot for them. Oh, boy. Don't look at me, please. Oof. <laughs> Ultimately, I did get you, huh? There is a striker right there. Uh, I'm going to say about the same distance. Maybe 900-ish. I want to boop him with a good sable round. Right there. Okay, maybe not. Uh, oh, he definitely sees me. Oh, yeah, he definitely sees me. Hold up. Okay, come on, Shell. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Load up fire, please. There it is. Beautiful. Right into his crew. Yeah, when you're shooting strikers, always try to aim for the center mass. Uh, maybe not side on center mass, but mostly a nice packet loss. Thanks, Gadget. Okay. I have four rounds left. I have an XM1 right in front of me. I think it is. Yes. I just got a breach. Commander. Okay, so uh, we're not exposed here. He should be able to pull back exactly like that. But he has to repair. So unless he puts his gun in a certain position, he's not going to be able to fire on us accurately. But one way to find out. Come on. They're right there. Beautiful. It's funny. We don't see Chrysler's out anymore. Are those things still on sale? Or Xbox exclusive? I don't know. Oh, crap. Left side. I hear him. I don't know what that is. Ah, Vickers MBT, huh? Ooh, okay, we got his horizontal drive, though, so he's going to have to pivot to hit us. Yeah, he has to pivot to hit us. Uh, if he's good, he'll get a good shot on us. Come on, fire, please. There it is. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Oh, crap. I'm out of ammo. <laughs> At least we got six kills. Uh, yeah, I'm screwed. Wait, 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 wait. I just got shot. I lost my turret ring. There's a capture point. It's open. There was someone hanging out in there. He just got killed. And this guy's about to boot me in the back of the turret and knock me out, isn't he? Yep. Oh, he tracked me. I was so close to victory. <laughs> Oh, well, off to the next. I'm getting close to a full up tier. We're at 9.7 right now, so that's interesting. And yes, I still brought the same 22 rounds, because why not? And yes, we're on the same app. I know. <laughs> Let's see how well this goes. I've got uh, an XM1 direct front right here. He's on the hard left. I'm dead. Oh! I can't believe I, I predicted that well! <laughs> <laughs> oh crap maybe he's not gonna help me oh really he potatoed a second shot dude i got so lucky holy crap <laughs> okay there's one right behind me i think he's coming this way i hear him there he is ztz 96 beautiful oh dude that is that is some streamer youtuber luck i don't even know what you want to call it okay german luck whatever <laughs> Is there anyone else? Nope. I hear something right in front of me. Oh, yeah. He's coming right this way. Uh, I think he's on the other side of that building, but we're going to... I've got multiple. I've got a lot of things coming my way. Oh. That's who I heard. And I forgot that side of the building was open. Nice play on me, buddy. All right. We're switching things up. Let's go for a, uh, a sniping maneuver. Oh, crap. Okay. Uh, that's not 1,500. Okay, maybe it is 1,500 right here. Can get him. 
right not down his pipe that is a 10 vehicle i believe it is that looks like a, a t72b 1989 uh oh no it was a turns all right <laughs> let's see if we can counter snipe whoever's out there i know there's one more there's a few more actually get him beautiful right in his engine right where i wanted it they're right there buddy there we go it's a Chrysler model again, I think. And next, we should do it in. Should do them in. Excuse me. <laughs> I just had dinner and it's, it's kind of coming back to <laughs> to meet me. So, yep. Well done. Well done. You know the one thing I don't like about Type 74s is their engine is incredibly loud and very distinctive. So you can immediately tell where it is what it is i mean more so than other vehicles so oh hey um i just saved you from a wally -E. you might want to yeah you might want to okay funny we're just talking about the guy and we end up saving him I, it took me a moment to realize what that was like the hell is that <laughs> so you're welcome yeah okay um not a solid, solid up tier, but well enough to say we're fighting with all the terms. <laughs> There's only two ways this game is going to go. Either we do okay or we get our butts kicked really well. We'll find out. Oh, dude, who the heck got to Bravo so fast? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, whoa, hamsters, don't choke on me, buddy. Easy now. Look at my ping and packet loss. Holy crap. Uh, oh, come on. Dude, 30% packet loss. Come on. Oh, the hamsters are croaking today. What? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Packet loss. Hold up, buddy. What are you doing? I'm <laughs> What's going on? I <laughs> <laughs> gotcha servers in a nutshell there's another one right in front that's a bill that's a friendly that is not a friendly right here though he's dead whoa <laughs> uh quality quality yeah, let's leave him go holy crap this packet loss what what the heck is going on here I don't even know if I can play this game, to be honest. I might have to... STRV, uh, Stritz forward and Stritz something. I don't even know what it is. It, it, it's something over here. He's... Where the heck is this guy? <laughs> uh, type 74, that's what it is. Okay, distinctive engine sound, of course. Go get him, buddy. Oh, there, there's a hit. Cool. Okay. Cool. Okay. Okay. Don't look at me. Dude, this whole game, 20% packet loss. Is it me? Or is it the server? <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, ooh, hey, hey, hold up. Hold up. XM... MBT something. There it is, XM803. That's what it was. Okay. <laughs> and it, my, my brain's turning off. I'm, I keep looking at the packet loss. My brain's like, uh, uh what's going on here? There's that guy. Oh, it's an Abrams. Oh, crap. Okay, he's gone. He's definitely going to get out of here. But let's see if I can get behind him. Knock him out if I can. Assuming his teammates don't come to the rescue. Oh, no. Go get him, Leopard. Actually, hold up. He's turned off his engine. Oh, he's smart. Didn't save him, though. <laughs> nice play, buddy. Okay, you know what? I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, skip this, I guess, because we're winning and the servers are croaking 40%. Yeah, we're, we're moving things up. Sorry, guys. So, US servers are kind of on the fritz right now and the game is really unstable. So, I'm hoping this kind of goes really well. And to top it off, I also switched things to heat FS. And yes, I am giving myself a bit of an advantage with thermal sites and parts in FPE and engine. But I figured, you know what? Why not drop back down and play with this round in a full up tier? It's not gonna go well, I can tell you that right now. <laughs> so let's see how well this goes.
Oh, hey, I can hole break that. Give me a second. I can, hole, I can totally hole break that. Beautiful. That was a weird hole break, but hey, that works. <laughs> so oh, I got someone else right here. I'm going to say about a thousand. It's twelve hundred. Why not? Yep. Right on the dot. He bounced. Uh, let's go ahead and lay some really quick. Come on. Right in the neck. Uh, right in his pipe. I think he's disabled. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, it's not gonna go well, I can already tell. I was, uh... Okay. I was pointing at something. Yeah, if I had a disable round, I would've destroyed him very quickly too, so... All right, let's uh, continue the sniping, I guess. That doesn't sound good. That's because it isn't good. Oh, no, come on, come on. Oh, oh, nice. He's got a friend, though. Hold up. Two for two. Come on. Yes. Two for two. <laughs> With heat FS. Beautiful. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, eh. Wait, 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 wait. We're good. We're good. Is that really 2,000 meters? Hold up. There's uh, that M1 Abrams is back again. Uh, 1,100. I'm right here, maybe. Ooh, no. Definitely a solid no, but he's very stuck. I'm trying to go for his neck. Come on. Or I could bounce. Oh, he bounced me. Come on. Right there, please. There we go. Beautiful hit. Uh, sort of. Come on, help me out here, game. Come on, non penetration. Uh, good thing I run extra rounds. He's still on fire. I think he's stuck. Not penetration again. Come on, game. It's the only time the Abrams is OP. <laughs> this is pretty. Seriously, I, I can't kill him. I'm trying to go for his neck. That that was a clean shot through his neck, through and through, and it did nothing. It's it's all right, buddy. I'm just giving you a bunch of points. I hope it's uh, hope this fades you a little bit. There we go. That's a good hit. That's the tank over to my left, isn't there? I just saw that shell. There we go. That's called a lucky shot. I just ate that. What the hell was that? Okay, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Ooh. Ooh, we dodged that. Hold up. What the hell was that? Oh, crap. 1,000 meters. 1,050 for good measure. Uh, Someone's nailing him currently. But it's all right, though. We have heat FS. We're totally effective right now. There he is. Oh, yeah, he's he's gone. I'm going to take a random shot. Oh, well done, little Bradley. Well done, indeed. Now, Port Novo, the map that is essentially the War Thunder equivalent to Tug of War. Seriously, you just hit the first person to carry that point will pretty much win. Unless the enemy team makes a mistake, which using heat FS in a pull up tier probably one of those mistakes oh crap hold up hold up hold up okay uh i i, I hear a t72 right in front of me oh yeah that is most certainly t72 is it the terms is it a 72a there's so many t72s i have no idea but one way to find out i know he hears me too oh. okay Maybe it was none of the above. It was it was a Chinese 96A. All right, cool. We got a lucky side shot on him. Man, dude's oblivious to me, too. Oh, oh crap. No, 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 no. Oh, we're good. He potatoed the shot. I will hull break him so fast. But I can't because uh, he's got friendlies coming in this way right now. I hear him. Okay, I need to get the hell out of this spot. I have an idea. I have a somewhat brilliant idea. Somewhat brilliant idea. Or actually, you know what? Maybe not. I was gonna, I was gonna throw my engine and just wait right here for that guy. Ooh, okay. Go ahead. Uh. <laughs> I gotta back up. It's all right. Let's take it out. Oh. Well done. Oh, 
Maybe not well done. <laughs> uh, are we gonna run into another Type 96? Let's see if we can waste some. He just shot our buddy from the back right here. Uh, he, uh, the, the ZTZ 96 has a, has a very thin cheek and he's looking the other way. I should be able to do this. Okay, maybe not do that. Um, okay. Well done, G91. I should have gone for the side of his turret. I, I don't know why I didn't do that, but you know what? I was kind of hoping for an ammo detonation, but I guess that's that. I got something coming up front. I actually have a very good spot right here to engage him. He's coming that way now. Beautiful. Missed all of his ERA or most of it and knocked him out. I think I killed him before. Sorry, dude. Okay, we're good. Well done, G91. Yeah, this game is uh, this game's over for them. Huh? BMP2M. Oh, God. No, 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 don't do it. Ugh. Okay. Lucky snapshot on my part. There's a BMP2M. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and pop smoke right here. Let's go, let's go. Okay, we are... Uh, we're not loaded yet, but there's BMP2 coming this way. Assuming he doesn't know I'm here because my engine's off, I should be able to maybe knock him out if he does come this way. Oh! God, I just... Oh, I just repaired it! Already is like, nope. I think there's someone going to my right now. Oh, those are friendlies I'm hearing. Oh. Okay, those are friendlies I'm hearing. I left, my right side is clear. My left, that BMP is still around here somewhere, but I don't think it'll matter anymore anyway. Oh, there he is. Oh, I can't get him, though. Come on. Beautiful. Oh, the game ends, too. Damn. All right. All right, so I'll be very upfront with you guys. Those last two games with Heat FS was a very terrible experience. I mean, sure, we knocked down two helicopters with heat rounds, which... When, when you know when you make contact with uh, helicopters using those rounds they do tend to blow up the helicopter very quickly but that's about it when it comes to their usefulness okay maybe a little bit of hole break here, here and there but still but that's besides the point okay heat fs in the 105 uh category has no place at 9.7 or 10.3 it's just it, it doesn't make sense to me because much of the community has been asking for a very long time to introduce some sort of low grade apfs ds or something to help alleviate this grind and when and when you have a vehicle like this that has some of those expensive modules found at top tier at battle rating 9.3 you know 27,000 32,000 per tier 4 modification and you got to do with heat fs man that's just almost just making you forcing you to use golden eagles to to get through with it which i never recommend for any vehicle depending on the circumstances but i'll get into that a little bit later but that all being said I understand why this is the way it is, okay? There is, in my honest opinion, a huge compression issue uh, with War Thunder, and it definitely needs to be addressed because as it currently stands right now, it's not helping vehicles like this or the C2A1 or Leopard 1A5 or the TAM, etc. It just, it doesn't. And when you start moving down some of the more powerful vehicles down to this battle rating or start introducing premiums that are absurdly overpowered at this tier, I'm looking at you, T72AV, uh, it really kind of destabilizes a lot of this this tier and ruins the fun for many, even myself, someone who has access to a lot of this stuff on day one. It's still very displeasing to see this kind of stuff be in play the way it is anyways. So yeah, I'm sorry if I went on a tangent right there, guys. I do apologize if it was bad. Um, let me know what you guys think about the uh, M48 Super. I keep saying Amex for some reason because <laughs> Super is in there. Uh, feel free to let me know down in the comment section below, guys. And uh, please don't ask me to make a video talking about compression or anything for that matter. There are plenty of creators out there who have covered it in full detail. I'd recommend you guys over to them, but they're very simple to find. So with all that being said, I hope you guys did enjoy everything. Uh, and I'll see you guys not only on the streams, which you should totally check out, or even the next videos, but in War Thunder itself. I'll see you next time.